Hey guys, so today I'm going to be showing you my play bins and I'm going to be making one more like a house, but it's going to turn into a play bin. This is the play bin I've already made, this is the main play bin. She's never been in this before. Basically it's just, um, you can't really see it, but it's just got my laptop today. I see it annoying me a bit. Oh god, that is so annoying. Right guys, this is going to work. I'm going to make it work. There you guys, that's kind of it. It's only small. So, basically, what I've got in it is a little house with the same material inside. Okay. tunnel and basically how you make these is you just press it together, cut um cut two big holes out of it, pop it up and then you have it. Which you love one. And this food thing. I made this brand name and it's got two treats in this one fish. Which is good she got treats and sugar thing. So that's just oh and what we've got in there is tissue paper. She loves tissue paper. So that's her main one. Um, something else you can put in it, but I haven't got food in that one yet. It's basically just this. Have my back cut in. Cut like that. It doesn't do anything. I ripped it, but I just want, because I've got it to my pants down, I don't want her to get stuck in there. So I basically just made this. So when she goes through, she can open the lid and she can jump out. And then just go back to its normal shape. Like that. Look at that. Let's so put in a playhouse. Sounds good. I've got some tissues. I might need to clean them off. I've got two. Because it's only this. I took the some wire out. Because like today I went to design a bear. And I um, had wire. And I thought this would be good for a house. And plus then I'll do the size of inches on it. And I'll basically want to do. Wait, guys, let me just take this back a bit. And basically what I can do is I can have this in the door, she can, and that's how big it is literally big, literally going to be. It's not really big is it guys? And then she's just got like a little window, yep. which is the best. I'm just going to say that's how it's up. Okay, but that's how it starts. So, for the bottom, we're going to go for tissues. So what I need to do is put it onto the top now, rip it, rip, put loads and loads of rips in there. Okay, I'm just gonna I'm not gonna put a lot in there because she didn't deserve to have a lot in there. Because then she can't move around. Oh my god, I'm gonna die. Oh, spins around a little bit. Just looking up. Excuse my face, guys. Um, she might want a little nest at the back. And then, like I said, I rip my paper into little sections and then just squares. And I'll shove it all in. Or sometimes I'll just do this and rip it up. Really randomly, guys. This video is in four minutes. Wow. Oh, cardboard. Not a good thing. I wanted exactly where I wanted that to go as well. Can't do it. 
Right, she wants a little nest. Look at the side she will, guys. She loves nests. She loves making nests as well. So, she's just got a bit of fluff around there. Here, I can't even see, you know, here, that's where her nest is, and then, sorry, you can turn that to wake up, she's not in here by the way guys, and then, around there, around this bit, it's just like a few little bits of tissue, it's not really bad, she loves, she loves that so much, and then one thing I'm going to put in, is just this, I've got two air holes, I'll show you in a minute, but I have got two air holes, And that's basically just it. That is my um, a play pen. And what I could do is I could actually join them two up. So like this, and then like that, and then like when she's in that, she can jump into that. So guys, so this is my big, big play pen. Both, both of them, actually both of them. They've actually got a bed in. One's got a nest and one's got a thing, so I'll show you that. It's like extra cool. I love this. I love this design. So, what she can do is she can come out of that hole. Wait a minute. I can't really see it very well. Sorry, guys. Um, she has this she has a little window from where you see the teddy bear. Okay, the box is there, actually, there. Um, I want to cover up the sides by my legs, so I'm going to like this when she's just climbing up so she can get out and then she can come out here and jump into her normal playpen so it's basically a big playpen like that I think that's pretty good and um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to use silly tape together so they're both together for that. That is um, going to be a really, really big um, playpen. So, you know, some people they probably just use this. So the playpen, just one. Just one box for the playpen. You can cut these off if you want to. Uh, I'm going to move that up there. Some people like it just like one, like that. So we the box one, like But I prefer bigger ones, so I would choose them to go together like that. So obviously can she jump out the window into there and it's so safe because she's got what I thought of it, I thought of it like a horse in a stable. A horse in a paddock, I call it. This is the stable, horse, stable and paddock. I call it the horse, which is the hamster, the stable which is the indoor bit, and the paddock which is the outdoor bit. So it's the indoor bit which is like kind of a stable. The folded bit here. Obviously, if she, I'd be super. If you're gonna make one that is super fun. Like um, and then so this is like the stable with air holes in. I made these bigger. I made the air holes actually bigger because I didn't think it was big enough. So I made them bigger. And then this is like the outdoor bit. Yeah, the outdoor. But um. I would put mm, tape on there, but of course I wouldn't. Apparently, I'll have to take this before I need to run it. And then, so I'll have to do. Put that like that up there. Put that then I was like, no, you won't be able to breathe, but I'll probably be able to put that like that. No, me. I'll change my mind on Esther. If she keeps trying to escape, then I'll just put tape on there. And then it's like in both indoor, but this one's got less space as you can see. 
Mine's laptop. As you can see, I lift it here. That's only got like one thing in it. No, this paddock has got like. Sorry, the act of it has got like. Everything in. That you can't. That you kind of need it, really. You've got like. Little tools. And yeah, a little shaker for food in. And then you've got like the house. And then in there you've got, you know. And <laughs> she doesn't, I'm going to wrap my hand with it. Chelsea Hubble and Jake Hubble. That's the dad of the Dunham Bell, which is my nephew. And then it's going to be like, and then off the internet, which I will post a pic on my wall. Um, of it. What I'll do is I'll kind of like um put on here hamster beware and then here I put hamsters hamsters play bit. So I've got like two apartments really. Um yeah, that's actually quite good. Two apartments like um so if I'm not talking about that. Um, so I'll probably put this, she keeps trying to, if she does keep trying, no, I'm gonna go, I need to speak to you guys, if she does keep trying to escape, then what I'll do is I'll, I'll put the, um, put the paper on, like that, but I won't, I'll make, and so she's got the holes. She wouldn't suffocate in there because I'll put a little holes in there. She would nibble at that, so I'd probably just put that like that. So that would look like that. I'm just going to um, go see if she's awake. If she is, I'll do a video on like your foot and I'll name it like. Um, your first time seeing my baby, which is my hamster. Um, but yeah, she loves this. She loves it. She really does love it. So thanks for watching, guys. Like, comment, and subscribe. No nasty comments, please. Bye.